Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I've got another Glitter Fairy haul. This one is quite substantial. This is two orders together that Lucy sent. So let's get into it. And I already know I've got my VIP, which has probably been delivered today to my work. And I think there's a couple of other orders. So get ready because there's a lot of glitter coming up. Let's get these all out first. So again, these are from the bargain basement and the final stocks from the Glitter Fairy. So I'll leave the link down below and my discount code so you can head on over there if there's anything you want to grab before we finally close down. Um, so yeah, this is some of my absolute favourites that I just needed to stock up on. So some of these are the 10 gram bags. So like these ones here are thicker. So these are definitely 10 gram bags. And then these ones here are just the standard five gram ones. So let's get into them. So these are, oh, <laughs> this is a bit sad. So this is another one of my glitters from the Christmas 2019 fairy collection. Um, I just wanted to remember it forever. So yeah, if you want to remember my time as a fairy, make sure you head on over and pick up one of these while you still can. It is a beautiful mix of holographic tinsel, white pink it's just beautiful i love it and i'm sure you will too um so yeah i've already got one in a pot i think i've got a spare one and this one so yeah i just don't ever want to run out i might frame one or something stupid but yeah just as a little memory because um, those of you that know, I was a massive fan of the Glitter Fairy before I became a fairy. Um, so yeah, it's just an honour to have been a part of the journey. I have had a lot of people ask about what's happening. Um, so yeah, maybe if you want me to do a full video to let you know what I know, then that's fair enough. But yeah, Lucy is closing because she wants to focus on bigger and better things. And we're all really happy for her. Us as fairies, we're, you know... We're still going to be fairies of some certain degree. We're not sure what yet, but we'll always be there to support Lucy and she knows that. So back to the glitters. I've got two here from the Zodiac collection. If you remember all that drama that went on, those, uh, well, however long ago it was, but haha, -ha, yes, the uh, Zodiac collection. <laughs> uh, so this is Sagittarius. This is beautiful. It's got holographic um, triangles in it predominantly pink but it's got some blues it's got those 3d stars in there that i absolutely love so yeah this is just another one of lucy's amazing mixes that i didn't want to be without so i made sure i got another one of those so yeah a lot of these are doubles i just if you know lucy's mixes you know lucy's mixes are amazing and i just i don't want to be without my favorites so this is another one of my favorites from the zodiac collection this is libra and again, this has got those 3D stars in, which I love. And it's got butterflies, circles. It's very iridescent, like teal and pinky. It's just beautiful. I love it. So I had to get another one of those before it is no more. Uh, these two are 10 gram bags and these are both from the Indian Summer Royalty Collection. This is Nawab and this is Maharani. So Maharani is a pink, it's got loads of iridescence in there, it's got hollow. So again, I've got both of these already, but I just don't want to be without. They are beautiful. Yeah. I love these. If you like the Indian Summer and you haven't got the Royalty Collection, you need to grab some while you still can, because these are delicious um and noir kind of reminds me of um persian princess but it's more on the purpley side so it has got that pink to it it's got the iridescence it is stunning i feel like i need to focus you a bit better there you go so yeah i've definitely got enough of this to last for a little while it's just such a beautiful mix and all of the Indian summers and the royalties are just stunning. So yeah, 
Then I've got some of the bridles in here. I'm going to see if I can get them together, but I can't. So this is Bridal Seasons Fine Super Fine in Autumn. So it's a beautiful, corally, peachy kind of a glitter. And yeah, it's going to be great for sugaring, things like that. I've got a client who loves just super fine sets. That's all she has. Um, you've probably seen some of her sets that I've done on here. So yeah. I was I had her in mind when I ordered those because I just thought it'd be nice to stock up on some super finds. Right, these are from the HD Pro um, glitters, which I didn't have the first time round. I don't know why. Um, so I've now stocked up. I'm just going to separate these ones out because there's the collection two just to make it a bit easier for you if you're looking on the website and you want to see which ones to buy. So this is another one of the bridal collection um, and this is Winter Fine. So again, a nice beautiful blue. I think this is a 10 gram bag as well. Yeah, it must be, that's a five. Um, so yeah, this is 10 grams. Can't remember which ones I've ordered now, which are 10s. Um, but yeah, this is beautiful for winter. I just love blues. I'm really into blues at the moment. And this has got a beautiful silver running through it as well. So yeah, love that. Just can't be without it. So if we go for the HD Pro Sunday Delights. Um, so if you don't know, Lucy is an ambassador for Hazel Dixon's acrylics. So these are made to match her Sunday Delights collection. So this is multi-cut, which is beautiful. I haven't had these before and I'm kind of kicking myself that I haven't. Um, but this has got almost like some red running through it and some silver as well. So it's beautiful, really deep and rich. So yeah, I've got some lovely acrylic colours that that would go really well with. Then I've got the super fine. This is a really deep purpley, it's just beautiful. So yeah, that's another one to add to my collection. I've actually filled up all of my glitter trays. Um, if you want an updated glitter storage thing video, let me know. Um, I'm definitely up for doing that, showing you how I store them um, and how much I've got obviously with the closing of the glitter fairy uh it's kind of getting out of control so i've just ordered um some more pots some more of the trays that i use so yeah i can show you how i pot them as well if you want to see just let me know if you want more information i can do that for you um so this is the chunky cut from the sunday delights and this has got some hollow in it um hex mix really deep purples oh hopes i'll get you in shot i've turned my ipad around so the camera is now down here whereas before it was up in this corner so i'm used to being like up over here but i've brought it back down here um so yeah super beautiful then these are just the hd collection too so i'm guessing these were just to go with some of the other powders that um hazel did so this is Icon. This is a beautiful lilac mix. So it's got some metallic, but it's also got some matte in there as well. That's that one. It's going to be lovely for spring. Could do a really nice floral set with that. Then I've got Exposed. This is lovely. It's a chunky mix, but it's also got some finer bits in it as well. And this is like an iridescent pinky purpley mix, but you've also got that um, hollow to it as well. So yeah, it's super sparkly, very pretty. Then we have Haven, which is lovely. This is really subtle, but it's got that iridescence to it. So this is like a light baby pink. Really pretty. Then we have Brazen. This is gorgeous. This is a holographic turquoise multi-cut. But also kind of minty as well. 
I'd say it's more minty than turquoise and it's got a little bit of hollow in there as well. Then we have Bossy. This reminds me of another glitter but I can't think of it off the top of my head but it's got iridescence in there. It's got like this corally rosy colour hex mix so it's a multi mix and you've also got that iridescent shimmer running through there as well but yeah that would go really well with like a nudie colour or you know like a caramel colour then we have smolder so this is kind of like the Indian summer um, so it's a really nice coral colour be beautiful for the summer it's not quite picking up how neon this is on camera but it's beautiful and it's got that iridescence like the indian summer collection and then this one is just one on its own this is holographic superfine in khaki self-explanatory just a khaki i like to make sure i've got all different colors I tend to lean more towards like purples and things like that um these are the disco mixes holographic disco mix um, so the holographic disco mix i have in purple and this has got stars um, stars tinsel hex diamonds it's good fun and it's all the same purple hollow tone just like a really chunky mix of all the same tone in there so that is beautiful and then we've got the same again in hollow silver so you can see there you've got all the different shapes in there then the same in candy floss which is this holographic pink And then the same again in old gold holographic. So yeah, I think they're just really fun if you want to add a little bit of extra to a set. So that's another haul from the Glitter Fairy. I hope you've enjoyed watching. I'll have some more really, really soon. So make sure you subscribe if you're not already. And don't forget to like and comment because it really helps me out. So yeah, I will see you in my next video, which should be coming up in a couple of days. So I'll see you then and have a good weekend. Bye.